Goods back in the long drive. Here we are again. Episode 40, I think this is. Maybe it's not. I don't know. I don't remember. I think it's 40. So thank you for tuning in again. How are you guys doing? I'm always concerned. I like always a little bit concerned. Everybody's not doing well. It's kind of, oh, geez, I've gone through like half my fuel. This engine sucks. I don't know why everybody loves it so much. But today we're going to try some new things and see if we can't make it a little more ridiculous. Um, yeah, so I should probably address this because I haven't not really yet. Uh, 1,000 subscribers. Um, over 1,000 subscribers at this point. I I honestly am in complete and utter shock. And you guys really need to find something better to do with your time. <laughs> oh, 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 I'm kidding. But thank you so much. I'm not going to make a big deal about it. I know a lot of YouTubers put out videos. I might at some point, uh, but my schedule does not allow for me to create videos outside my normal uh, creation schedule, which is every day. So I'll see if I can do something to address it. There's a lot of people I need to thank. And you know who you are. The ones who comment regularly. There's a rabbit. He's coming. He's coming right for us. Get away. I'm busy having a moment. No. Okay. Now you, now you want to autosave. Now you, okay. Now you want to autosave. Don't you, don't you do it. Okay. So like I was saying, there's so many people I should thank from Jacob Bomberito to my hand doing this weird thing that I'm doing when I'm walking to Hank to Justin Kelly to like, there's so many, I, I can't even get into it. You know who you are, but thank you so much. Like I said, I don't think I'll ever be a big YouTuber like some of those guys, but uh, just to know that some people enjoy what I watch, a couple hundred views I get on these videos, means the world to me, guys. So thank you so much. I appreciate it very muchly. And uh, I'm going to get this fuel tank out while I'm here. Come on, wedge out, wedge out. Oh, no. There you go. There you go. But I appreciate it a lot. It gives me something to do with my time. I don't exactly do a whole lot. I work. That's my life, <laughs> his work. So yes, thank you so much for the thousand subscribers. I, I have nothing else to say that'll make that feel any better than it already is. So thank you. And I hope you continue to watch and I'll continue to try to put out shitty content like I always do. So back to this, we're filling up our car um, because I ch chew through fuel in this thing like a maniac, like an absolute monster. What do we gotta do? Quick rabbit check. I saw a rabbit in the distance over there. Where'd you go, buddy? Oh, ho, 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 ho. you just know they're waiting for you. Okay, I just want to see it. There we go. I like to know how much is left to be putting in it because I know I know when to turn around because rabbits are only going to get you when you're on the bitter end of your fuel, which also means we need more fuel. Like a lot more fuel than we have because this engine is sucking it up like crazy all the time. At least this thing will lighten the load a little bit. Alrighty. Okay. Let's uh, put this down, I guess. There we go. Okay. What happened? Why is this happening? Why can't I? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I can't. Okay, here we go. All right. Well, something was going on with that. How much is left here? 34 liters. So we have to get this like this and then stick this back in the car. Oh, that's a little easier to move, thank God. All right. Okay. Oh, God. It's, we're having a moment. It's having a moment. It's having to just get in there gently. Put this. No. What? I heard a rabbit. I heard a rabbit. Okay. We got to go. This is going to be a problem any second now. No, 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 no. Why won't you close? Why won't you close? What? Okay. Okay. Thank you very much for wasting my fuel. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Oh, yeah. How far are we along here? Let me see. So 750, it looks like, is where we're trying to get today. Okay. There we go. 750 kilometers. Jeez, what was that? That was a bad shift. Oh, God, there you go. Someone was right. Okay, so someone told me if you just let off the throttle a little bit for a second, it'll just start picking up speed if you hit it again. 
And they're kind of right, but it's not doing it. Oh, there it is. But it doesn't hold the speed. It's that torque band, man. It just kicks in. Holy jeez. Look at it go. Yeah, it doesn't hold the speed, though. You eventually get back down to earth here. <laughs> okay, that was a little of not talking for long enough. So, yeah, seven... F oh, no, the gas tank's open. Sugar beets. Parking brake on. Don't hit that rock. Okay, we gotta do this quick. Okay, back in the car. All right, here we go. Come on, car. There we go. Don't hit the rock. Jeez, and crackers. Okay. That was real close. We still have our Harry Potter broom for an emergency, but that's it. Now, I still think we should swap this engine out or do something stupid with it. And I don't know what that thing is yet, but we're going to figure that out at some point here. Look at that. Oh, God, it just pulls suddenly. Look at that. You just let off the gas and then hit it again, and it jumps way above where you were. Look at that. Oh, my God. Okay, come on. Oh, yeah, we're going to bury the speedometer. Come on. Oh, there it is. It's okay, Rock. <laughs> we don't want to deal with that. Oh. So tomorrow, uh, we have uh, B-Man G coming out again. I don't know what I'm going to do, but ooh, someone told me there's a LiDAR version of Pike's Peak, and I have always wanted to race at Pike's Peak. And not that I do hill climb racing. It's just something I've always wanted to do. So I might go download that and check that out. And for all the people in the comments who are all like, use the controller. Use the controller. I can't use analog sticks. They're weird and they don't feel right ever. But you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to give it a shot. And you'll see how bad it is. Like, it is so bad when I try to use a controller of any sort. Like, ridiculously bad. And no, people are like, oh, you'll learn it. No, you, you don't understand. How long have analog sticks been around? Never learned it. Tried it dozens and dozens and dozens of times. Never gotten better. Analog sticks are my nemesis. My nemesis in every way. Now give me a fighting stick, you know, for them fighting games with the ball on top, the old arcade style sticks. I'll whoop your ass in any match of Street Fighter you want. And I'm serious. I can whoop ass in Street Fighter. I am like a Street Fighter maniac. But those little analog sticks, man, they're just uncomfortable and awkward and my thumb slips around on them and I don't like it. Give me a mouse and keyboard all day. You know what else I really like? Old school controllers with just a directional pad. They're nice for certain types of games. Like, what was the one I was playing with that? Oh, what was that game? Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, I was playing, um... Oh, Starbound. Um, or is it Terraria? One of the two. I played with one of those. Works great. Works wonderful. Don't need no analog stick. It's perfectly fine with that. And uh, shoot it off. Boom. Okay. But yeah, we're going to give it a shot with the controller and see what happens. And it might be hilarious at Pike's Peak, me trying to use a controller to get up a mountain. Because I'm so bad with them. Like, you have no idea. People kept saying it. And it's just like, dude, you have no idea. I hate them. I hate them so much. Not that they have a problem with consoles. Don't get me wrong. If you like consoles, all the power to you. I'm just like, Nintendo, for example, has some of the best titles ever made. And uh, the, last, the Last of Us was terrible. But anyway, the point is... PlayStation has good stuff too. So does the Xbox. Oh, Devil Road. Minor Devil Road. It's more like uh, an imp. An imp road. Or a... What's a minor devil? I don't even know. It's more Devil Road. It's, it's coming. You can feel it. Point is, I will, I'll, I will give it a shot just because you guys asked and you'll just watch it go horribly, horribly wrong. The only thing that might be nice is the progressive triggers will work well for the gas and the brake. That I'll give you. But as for the steering, it's going to go south so fast. So fast. I promise you. What do we got here? Oh, we got a little... What is this? Oh, it's a bus stop. Oh, there's a Karen. Oh, no, we don't need a Karen. Come on. Forward. Onward. Sorry, Karen. You're going to have to wait. 
The bus is coming. I saw it back there, Waze. You'll be fine. It has no wheels, so he's got to find those first. Yeah, so here we are in the desert. One more time. Onto the breach. I keep... You know what's funny? I never saw one of those... Uh, those crosses. In, in the, I found that cross that one day. And I, I, I'd never seen one before. And now I see them all the time. I just wonder if I wasn't noticing them and thought they were trees or something. What's that? What's that over there? Oh, is that a is that a watchtower? That's got to be a watchtower, right? Look at this flat ground. I've been asking for this for days. Just flat, easy terrain, no big hills. It's wonderful, just wonderful. I like this. I like this so much. This is so much better. This way is just better. A little slow because of this bus engine, but other than that. This is going well. I like it. We got something coming up here. Looks like a small gas station maybe or a house. Can't tell at this distance. We got an object. There you go, launch it forward. I just got done watching season two of Cobra Kai for the second time. Really like that show. Who doesn't like a little karate kid? Wahwa. <laughs> That's like a great show, man. There's all this fighting and cheesy acting. It's my favorite thing. I like bad movies. That's my thing. I like bad movies. Like, if a movie is so bad, like, wretched bad, I love it. Like, uh, The Room, you know, Tommy Wiseau, like, you gonna remember him? I did not hit her, I did not. That guy? Yeah, love that guy. L You're tearing me apart, Lisa! That guy, he's amazing. He sells his own underwear. But I go buy Tommy Wiseau's underwear. Everybody should have a pair of Tommy Wiseau underwear. What do we got going on here? Oh, we got a well? Well, well. Okay. What do we got? We got a bumper. We got a pack of cigarettes. We got another bumper. We got a well. I don't see anything on the roof. What's around back? We got a Karen. We got two Karens. Oh, hang on a sec. I see something I want. Okay, put that put that on. Okay, there we go. Let me out. No seat belt in this. So you and your friend, I see. How's it going? I haven't seen you since uh, the bus stop. It's good to know. Here. Go check out what's going on down there. Heard just treats. Kit Kat bars and whatnot. There. Oh, oh, no, you don't. No, There's road lotion! Well, at least you won't be alone. Okay, now the cake it out. All right. I gotta sleep through this night. Oh, in the car, because I don't trust the, uh, the rabbits not to come on in. You ever seen them hop against your car? I swear they're trying to get in. I swear it's up and down and sideways. They're trying to get in the damn car, and it scares the crap. Oh, sun's in my eyes. Oh, yeah, it's morning. There we go. Okay. Okay, I just hit a wall, apparently. All right. There we go. This is better. Rabbit, look out! Sorry, bud. Oh yeah, we still need a hubcap. I forgot we lost one. Okay, yeah, we gotta find a hubcap too. We gotta get your motor running. No, we don't want to. We don't want to sing. That's copyright infringement, apparently. Now that I'm monetized, apparently I can't. I can't sing any of my songs anymore, for some reason. Like I get it if you're singing the whole song, but if you sung one little thing, do the, the, the companies really think that someone listened to your video is like, well, I'm only listening to this because they, they, they sang, like four seconds of a Taylor Swift song or something? Seems dumb, but hey, what do I know? I'm not that smart. Look what I look what I do for fun. <laughs> oh, oh, oh yeah, this is this is my entertainment. Is entertaining you guys? It's great. There's that thing over there again. That's another thing I gotta check out. Those things that look like sea forts. I wanna check one of those out. My luck, though, is I'll fly up there and then lose my broom. I really wanna learn to control the broom better. It's one of my goals in life. Where are we at now? Oh, we're 14K into this. We're doing great. This is a perfect trip. We hit one with a wall. It's my own fault. Still have both my headlights. I'm off the road. And you gotta be careful when you get back on the road. Sometimes the thing catches you, and then you just flip. And it's ridiculous. I'd like to see a real building, though. I haven't seen any good real buildings yet. 
And like I said, I still want to dump this just dump this into a, a Skoda. Because I think it'd be great. And we'll just move on from the Dacia. This thing's been great, though. Don't get me wrong. We've had it since... Jeez. Since my car got stuck in the wall. I think that was... It was that episode we had to build the car with the two-stroke. The Skoda with the two-stroke. And then... Yeah, we found that this was red when I found it. And now there's not a red panel on it. But it's time for a change, people. The winds of change are blowing. And they're blowing in the direction of a Skoda. I guess you smell that. That's Cold War. That's what you smell. This is Eastern Block smell. Yeah. It's been a good car, though. I can't deny it. It's too bad it's front-wheel drive, though. You know, that is a point against it for sure. But that's okay. We can live with this. We're doing all right. And if this gets me to the Olive Garden in my mom's house, I'm okay. This is fine. There's an end to this somewhere. And we're going to find it. We're just at about 2,500 kilometers. So, like, we're, we're really... I can't remember what I was at the last... I mean, usually, I check. And I totally forgot to check. But, uh... Last few episodes, I've done that. Because I've been in a hurry to suddenly record. But, yeah, there's, uh... There's a whole like 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 thing about me hitting 2,500 kilometers. That's halfway through this, and that means we're like halfway there. And I'm still haven't decided if I might want to do uh, the return trip. <laughs> I've been considering it for a while about just doing the return trip. There's something over there. Is that a ship or a house? I don't know. The road kind of curls over that way. Someone who's like, oh, just drive across the desert. They want to see me just drive across the desert. How boring would that video be? Just doing this. Like, you don't even have to really turn except to avoid rocks and stuff. I don't know if I want to do that to you guys. I feel bad. I feel bad if you're watching this as it is. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is, uh, this is going to be one of those things. So I can't believe I died, by the way, in my summer car. What a horrible way to die. Saving a drunk man. You know, that's what we do. We're heroes here. You always got to be the hero. Show mercy. Help those people out. It's not so bad. And I don't have my headache anymore, so I'm all in a good mood. Because I had it for two days, and this is this is a lot better. Not having it. Headaches suck. So about once or twice a year, I'll get a migraine. And then you're locked in a room in the dark for two days. Trying not to think. Thirts to think. Now, what's nice about being in the desert is you don't have to worry about the road rocks as much. And there's, you can see them a lot easier. Because they don't blend into the road. Oh, we're gonna just cut through here. This looks like a, this looks like a big house. This might have a Skoda. Sometimes these have cars. Well, they usually have cars. Well, let's say eighty percent of the time, it's just a lot, most of the time they're kind of mangled. But we'll just get a Skoda and, and go for it and see what happens. I think this car's played out. But at the same time, we need to know how many kilometers we've gone. And currently, it's about 20. All right, here we go. Around that thing. Get the wind's picking up. This is okay. We don't want a sandstorm. Oh, that'd be a cool thing. Sandstorms. Slow it in here. Oh, we got something. What's this? What is this? That's not a Skoda. That is a, a Trabant. Well, this thing just goes real fast in reverse. Whoa, okay, whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh, God, I'm stuck. Okay, 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 hubcap. Speaking of which. Okay, we lost this hubcap. There should be a hubcap over there. There we go. All right, I'll grab the hubcap off of this Trabant. And then we'll move on. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, okay. If it's got hubcaps, it probably has hubcaps. Oh, it has a hubcap. It does. Look at this tiny little thing. It's adorable. That's that's a that's a cute car. That's the kind of car that's just adorable. It's the kind of car you just want to like hang out with and you know be its big brother because his dad left him when he was a child. Yeah, that's a good time. Okay, let's see. Actually, I think it's like a mint one too. This is this worked out. Look, there's a bed on the roof. There's another bed on that roof. No, that's just the other part of the roof. Never mind. False alarm, people. False alarm. Now, I'm pretty far from my car, so I better not run into any rabbits. 
Okay, let's see here. We got you. We got basket. We got another gun. We have a... Is this like a super mint radiator? Look at that. That's pretty slick. We already have a mint radiator. That's alcohol. A sponge. Look at all the beds. Who's sleeping here? Uh, nothing under that bed. Okay, sometimes there's a barrel of something around the corner here. Not today. And there's always a well out front. I see you, rabbit. I'm not dumb. All right, back to the car. Can we pee anything out? Oh, whatever it was is gone now. <laughs> Tiny little bladder on this guy. All right. What are we at now? Let's see. 20 kilometers? 30 to go. Okay, there we are. Back to the road. Looks like we got a ship over here. It looks like we might have a big gas station or something over here. What's that? Is that a rock? No, that's a building. Maybe that'll have a Skoda. That's how I'm going to say it for now. Skoda. Yeah, this is my favorite game right now. When I'm, like, feeling, ugh, I don't know what to play or I'm a little bored, this is what I go and do. By the way, I picked up a free game on the Epic Game Store, uh, Railroad, Railway Empire, Railroad Empire. Boy, is that fun. It's like an old Railroad Tycoon game. So if you like Tycoon games or real-time strategy or that kind of, or that ilk, go check it out. It's awesome. What is going on here? Okay. Is that, is that a big gas station or is that a little gas station? I think it's a big gas station. No, it's a little gas station. What is this? Oh, it's just a little gas station from behind. Okay. It makes a lot more sense now. All right. Nothing here worth getting. Nothing I can see anyway. That second gear shift, it just bogs down suddenly. That looks like a ship. I wonder if we should go get diesel. Because we're going to be down to our last tank of diesel here soon. I'm wondering if we should do it. Wait a minute, there's something else over here. Well, he does, like last game, he couldn't find a building near the second half of my video. And now there's like all over the place. There's something up here. It might just be a rock, I guess, but no, nah, don't, rocks don't uh, spawn in at that range. So it's something for sure. There's a house over there, look. Look, there's buildings everywhere this time. I don't want to go to the house, but I definitely want to head on down this road. See where we're at here. Yeah, that's something. That's something, all right. There we go. There we go. Come on, speed up. There we are. Oh, yeah, look at this. Probably saves me some fuel doing this. Like, I'm concentrating so much I can't talk. Okay, there we go. Okay. Yeah, there's something. Does it go back towards the road? Oh, God! Oh, God! See, this is what the bus engine does. It wants to flip your car. It's so heavy. Oh! I thought I was going to lose it. Okay, I'm spinning here for some reason. Okay. I was gonna lose it for a second. Is that a big garage? Is that what that is? I like big garages. They got full of stuff. It might be a big garage. Yeah, I think it is. I think that's a big garage. I like those. They always have like lots of well. Sometimes you open them up and there's like eight things inside. Other times you open them up and you can't even get in them. There's so much crap. Oh, oh there's a rabbit. The road doesn't even wrap this way. So this is kind of out in the middle of nowhere. Although I think I see the road way off in the distance there. It's hard to tell, really. All right. We'll pull on up to this. Nope, it's another small gas station. All right, whatever. Been a lot of those today. It's about the third one I've seen. All right, that's fine. We'll pull in here. Well, okay, go up in a rock. They look weird from the back. Okay. There's a bike. Okay, okay. 
Wait a minute. Stop, 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 stop. All right. Is the parking brake on? There it is. It is now. All right. Now, if somebody wanted to see this. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. So let's get this. Bring this over here. We're going to give something a shot. What is that sound? What is that? What's in the tank? Fuel tank is empty. All right. All right. We got a road lotion in our computer still. That's what I wanted to know. I'm going to pull this out. All right. Put this over here. We'll put two liters of diesel in this. Put this back in my car. Uh, okay. All right. Get in there. All right. Take this. Put that on there. Close that up. Oh, we're missing this hubcap still, aren't we? What the? Oh, now we need another hubcap. See, this is my problem. I'm too worried about prof Oh, my God. Kismet. I found it. Easy enough. Okay. Now comes the harder part. All right. Okay, engine. I need you to come out. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's on my head. Nope. Okay. We just spilled all the fuel out of it. That's fine. That's okay. We're going to take this off. Oh, yeah. Put the engine in it. Okay. Okay. Come on. Um, well, it's out. <laughs> oh, no. Perfect. All right. It's kind of far away right now. <clears throat> you go there. You go here. I just need you to... Oh, there it is. Okay, there we are. Okay. Oh, there's only a little bit of diesel in it, but it's enough to get it running. Don't do that. Hey, stop that. Come on. Oh, God. Oh, God. Ah! <laughs> there we go. It only does like 35. Oh my God. <laughs> I've already chewed through half that diesel. And it rubs on the ground. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Kickstand. <laughs> okay, I gotta get off this. How do you shut this thing up? Okay, that was a little dangerous. And the engine's starting to heat up. <laughs> so that's not good. Use this as a screenshot. There's a bunny over there. Quick, dismount. Oh, not this now. Not now. Not now, please. Crap. And my diesel all fell out. Okay. Okay, the <laughs> where'd the engine go? I'm gonna need it. Okay, this rabbit's gonna come and get me. I can feel it in my in my left testicle. He's coming. He's coming. You can feel the weather change, too. Come on, buddy. Don't get any closer. I'm not tolerating your crap. There. Get in there. I'm going to need the hood. Just stay over there, bud. <laughs> get on there. Okay, there we go. Take this diesel canister. We'll fill up what's left of this in the tank here. Open that up. There we go. Just fill it up. Ignore the rabbit. He's not coming. He's not trying to eat your face. Oh, God. He's right behind me. I can feel him breathing his rapid breath. I can smell carrots from a mile away. Okay. Get in there. All right. Rabbit, where are you, bud? How did my, uh... Oh, no. 
The road lotion's gone. And the computer. Oh, God. We're just going to sleep for the night and hopefully he leaves. I saw the computer in the back seat. I think we're fine. Okay. Sleep it out. Sleep it out. Okay, that might that, that's the engine over there on the ground. Where's the road lotion? All right, we're good. This broom is tickling my neck. That's fine. Ah! Okay, where are you? Where are you? I can't see because the thing's up. Where'd you go? Where are you? I heard screaming. I heard it. Did you? Everybody heard the screaming. Okay, look, Rabbit, if you're going to scream, at least have the decency to show up. Okay. Okay. How much How much gas is in there? There's only eight liters. Fuck that. I'm not going to stay around for eight liters of gas. All right. We're out of here. I'm not dealing with this. I'm not dealing with it. Oh, no. Which way's the road? Okay, road's over here. There we go. How far do we got left to go here? Oh, we're only about halfway through this. All right. Gas tank is open. God damn it. Uh, can I reach the gas tank from here? Uh. No, I can't. Okay. Oh, God. What happened? Oh, I got on the broom in the car. That's weird. Or is it? Put the broom in the car and fly it in the car. Would the whole car fly? Questions, questions, questions. For the next episode of The Long Drive. That's what we're going to do in the next episode. We're going to use that that broom and see if we can't make the car fly. Okay, gas tank is closed. We made a bus-powered bike, and it was horrible. Okay, it just dragged on the ground. Perfect. Now we just got to go 25K. And that's easy. There we are. There we are. Okay. My mouth's getting dry. I need a drink, and I don't have any drink here with me today. Normally I have a bottle pop or something, but I don't have any. Okay, okay. Okay, so then what we gotta do? There's one of those towers over there. I can't do everything in one episode. There's just too much to do in this game. You always think there's not that much to do, but there's a lot. Like, you can do all sorts of stupid crap. Although we're eventually run out of stupid crap we can do, but I guess we'll figure that out when it happens. Look at this. This is good. Is that a is that a, another building over there? Maybe. I just want the Skoda. I think it's time we ditch this engine too, because it gets such poor gas mileage. It is not worth it. And why do people keep trying to make me take the bus? The bus is boring. It's a bus. Here, a little little fact about me. I've ridden the bus exactly one time in my lifetime, and I live in a major city. One time. I've lived here for 20 plus years, maybe. One time I've ridden the bus. Once. Ever. I'm not knocking people who ride the bus. Bus is a great way to get around. Just, I just don't like buses. I don't find them exciting. I find them kind of annoying to have to wait to go somewhere. I want to go when I want to go. I'm selfish like that. Don't judge me. Take a bike, skateboard, longboard, pogo stick. Uh, one of those little horsies that used to look like a broom. Yep, do it all. Before I'll take the bus. Trampoline, move it, jump, move it, jump. Yeah, I'll do that. Ooh, this is a bunker. Oh yeah, someone told me you can drop boxes. But I'm not sure I would get a box up the ladder. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe I can just like, oh no, I can't do that, can I? Oh, maybe I can. Hang on a second. We're going to try to break a box open while we're here. See, there's so many things I got to do. Got a red little basket. Tisket a tasket. Okay. Ignition off. Let me out of this car. All right. Come this way. Oh, you don't even fit out the door. Okay, can we put you up on the roof and drop you off the roof, maybe? Okay, there you go. Uh, all right. Climb this ladder. Hey, look, there's stuff on the roof. Okay. Now, someone says they break if you drop them off the roof. Or drop them from a few feet up. So, 
Here we go. They lied to me. <laughs> they just, they straight up lied. <laughs> you got a wire brush up here, though, which I haven't needed one of those in a while. No, it doesn't seem to do anything. What's this? Is this oil? That's gas. Actually, I probably should check my oil. I haven't in a while. Got some gray paint. Yeah, there's just nothing here. Anything outside? Okay, so what if I can throw this? Ow! What if I hit it with my car? Let's try that. Back it all. Okay. Hey, broom. Okay. It does kind of look like ramen noodles, Jenna. <laughs> okay. Okay. Ready? Go. Oh, this is going to cause a problem. Ah! Nothing. Nothing. Ah! Ah! ah, problems. Okay. You win that round, box. Screw you. I'm leaving. <laughs> that box tried to murder me. I still have my computer, though. Although the road lotion's gone. We need to find new road lotion. I don't see it anywhere. Is that on my... Oh, my God. I'm turning around completely backwards. <laughs> okay. Is that on my feet, is it? No, it's just gone. Must have flipped out when I flipped out of the car. Oh, there's one of those uh, sea fort looking things. El Capitan Broom may be the one to uh, help deal with that. Why am I not on the road? What, like, what, what am I doing here? At least the engine isn't overheating anymore. But yeah, this is going to run out of fuel unless I find a boat. Which I'm going to have to... I got the hiccups again. Why do I get the hiccups when I'm recording? Who does that? Stupid body. Watch it. What is that? My diaphragm causing this? My duodenum? Something. I heard a pancreas. It's my pancreas. No, it's not my pancreas. Pancreas do not do that. <laughs> oh, it is one of those forts. Man, this is... The, everything's just coming into alignment today. I really need to... My microphone keeps moving. I need a new mic arm. Anybody got a suggestion? My mic arm's getting a bit loose. I do use it a lot, though, so it's not like it's been a bad mic arm. It's just a bit loose. Yeah, dude, we could, like, fly up to that and see what's going on. Although, I don't think there's anything in those things. There's a boat over there. A boat over there. A boat over there. No boats nearby. We can use some more diesel. What's that? Yeah, it's just a boat. And I haven't seen a radio tower in probably five episodes, six episodes at least. Ever since I grabbed the computer to do this with. Yeah, that's a boat for sure. Something over there too. Okay, well, I'm not going to fly up to that thing today, but we're definitely going to go see what that thing is over there. There's a little dot on the horizon. That's something. We'll go there. Look out, rabbit. Get out of the way. Coming through. There's stuff all over the place now. What is going on? So I figured it out, by the way. I was watching South Park, and it all makes sense now. These aren't rabbits. It's the hair club for men. That's who it is. They just run around causing problems for everybody. Or they hop around, for that matter. That might be a ship over there. I'll check that out. It looks like it's close enough to the road. Okay. Oh, no. What happened? Why am I stuck? What's going on? Whoa! Whoa! Jeez, the, the, the strangeness of the physics engine in this game is enough to make you want to hurl. Blow chunks, as the kids used to say. Is that a radio tower out there? No, that's just another watchtower. Jeez. What is this? Is this just a well? Is this what this is? No, bus stop. With the bus. Hey, bus. What's going on, buddy? Oh, you're like a, you're a bright, shiny bus. Look at you. Okay, let's, uh, let's shut this down for a sec. Man, there's, there's a lot of stuff happening in this episode already. 
Okay, what do we got here? Well, we got a bus. That's what we got. Fuel tank's got nothing in it that'll run. Well, okay. And only 28 liters of it. Let's see. Open her up. It's got a leaky radiator and a full-fledged bus engine. Okay. And whatever this business is. Must be the transmission. Okay. Ugh. Will it even start with that mixture of fuel in there? Let me see. There's a little bit of diesel in it. Okay, let me up. Let me up. Let me up. All right, let me see here. Bit in the seat. No, it won't run. You'd have to drain it and everything, and I don't have time for that. Uh, what's this? This is the fuel tank. You can access the fuel tank from in here. It's rolling away. Goodbye, bus. That's kind of handy, actually. You can fuel it from the inside. Look at this. This is the pivot point of the bus. Yeah, it's definitely rolling away. But I don't have enough diesel to run this bus, even if I could drain it. What the? Oh, my God. We can just walk it along. What the hell? Yeah, come on, bus. Go. Okay. <laughs> There we are. See you around, bus. Okay. That was actually a good bus. But I'm not taking a bus. I don't care how many people times people ask. I don't like the bus. It handles like crap. It isn't fast. And it chews through fuel. All like devil road. This is the choices you make. Then you get devil roads. Okay. okay de stop it, devil road. I don't have time for you right now, bud. I got other things I got to do. Whoa. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This is aggressive. Devil Road, I apologize for my, my misgivings about you. My throat's all gurgly from my allergies. Okay, Devil Road, I'm sorry. You've been really good this episode, and I apologize. You don't have to get all... You're getting uppity. You're getting uppity. Now you're putting little rocks in you? Come on, bud. What are you... Like, seriously, bro. Why would you do this to me? Why would you do this to me? There you go. Thank you. Relax, Devil Road. Look. It's not the same as it used to be. My car doesn't bounce all over you anymore, but I still respect your ability to exist. You know, I'm not telling you you can't exist. I'm not telling you who you are and who you can't be. Just, it's okay. Shh, calm down, Devil Road. Thank you. Jeez, we still love you. Everybody loves the Devil Road. Everybody loves it so much. Okay. Whoa, there's a rock right there. Okay, well, we got a ship out here. With something beside the ship, actually, as well. You know what? I do need diesel. Maybe we should check that ship out. Maybe, maybe, maybe not. Votes. People, vote. Cast your votes now. I have our 9800 our not, our 900 number. Okay. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, I want to. I want to. Oh, 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 I'm thinking about Oh, we're back! I thought too much! That's what thinking gets you. Just, okay. All right. What What is squealing? Um, I need to get out now, please. Okay, just push it over. Push, okay, there you go. Thank you. Thank you and relax. I don't know what to do. I'm so stressed. I don't have road lotion. This is the problem. When you don't have road lotion, when you don't have road lotion, things bad bad things happen. Okay, all right. We got a little thing coming up here. How much gas do I have? Ah, uh, we're not down that far. So we still got enough to get where we're going. We only got ten kilometers to go. Yeah, we'll just we'll just bear this out in the next episode, unless we find a uh, a Skoda from here on out. We'll just not worry about it. Skoda, Skoda. Gonna find you and drive you so hard. Ba -dum -ba -ba -dum -ba. I should do some of my own theme songs, I think. Devil Road, take me home. Oh, to the place. I belong. Olive Garden and my mama take me home Devil Road yeah nope not a singer 
He's singing a band. As you can tell, I'm not a famous musician. So you can see how that turned out. As a famous musician, well, I'd probably still be doing this because I just like doing stupid crap like this. This little gas station here. Let's pull on in here, see what's going on. What's up, bud? What you doing, bro? Got any good news? What's the word? We got we got things. Oh, no, we don't have things on the roof. I always think those are things on the roof, but they're not. They're not things on the roof. They're just the things that hold up the sign. There we go. Turn the, it's the first time I've had my lights on in this episode. Okay. Yeah, we got enough gas to get through this, this but eventually we're going to need to find fuel. I feel like the car's sitting lower for some reason. Does it look lower to everybody else? Is something, I can't see. I can't see. Don't do, don't do this to me, son. We're supposed to be friends. Thank you. Me and that son used to get along great. He said he got uppity since he's all in the sky now and looking after everybody. And some people worship that guy. Like Ra. People call him Ra in some places like the Egypt. Those people live in denial. Ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. Psh. <laughs> Dad jokes. They're the best. Okay. Oh, yes. Yeah, so we had to remind me. I was going to ask. If anybody's got any really bad movies to recommend me, I've got a few for you. But please put them in the comments below. But I'm going to recommend a few for you. Okay, you ready for this? Here you go. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to recommend three. And I'll explain why. Robo Jocks. It's from the 90s. It's about these mech warrior things. We had no budget. Worst special effects you've ever seen. And it feels like they pulled people off the street to do the acting. That's movie one. Watch that. Movie two by a director called Herschel Gordon Lewis. A movie called Gore Gore Girls. It's about a stripper who's killing people. And the music in that movie is the best. Because they couldn't get the rights to any real music. So they used uh, public domain music. And it was, it, was, it was amazing. Ready for this? Whoa, what's that? Okay. So, look at the way that the light comes in. So... Movie three, and this one, I'll tell you right now. This one, are you ready for this? This one is a doozy. It's called 50-50. It stars uh, Peter Weller and the another dude, I can't remember his name. Peter Weller was the original RoboCop, and it's about these two mercenaries, and it's friggin' awful, and it's, it's the best kind of awful. It's poorly written. It's a bad action movie. The guys barely look like they know how to use their guns. It's basically an instant classic, to be quite honest. Just so good. Oh, yeah. And as a bonus one, Orgasmo, about a, a porno Mormon superhero. Yes, you heard that correctly. Who wears a thing on his arm that caused people to orgasm. So, oh, no, no, no. Okay, stop the car. Stop the car. Stop, 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 stop. Brakes on. Out, out, out. Uh, one. Uh-oh, uh-oh. He's stealing me. Don't do it. I'm gonna, you son of a bitch! <laughs> you got, the pellets do nothing! Why can't I get back in my car? Let's go. All right, well, we tried shooting it and it didn't mean anything. Who would have thought an interstellar spacecraft can't be taken down by BBs? You know, like that's the best weapon we got. That's all we got. That's how we're gonna fight the aliens. Couple kilometers to go. That was good. That's a good way to end this off. This is working out rather rather well. I enjoy this game though. Like still to this day, after starting to play it again, and since he's updated, the performance is better. And you know, they they added the broom and and all that stuff and the new car. Yeah, it's just been great. I just uh. In those moments when you have nothing better to do, just go for a drive. A long drive. It's the way it should be. It's the way everything should be. Just get in your car and go. If you don't have a car, well, get on your bike. And if you don't have a bike, ride your dog. Or your girlfriend. Or your boyfriend. Or your neighbor if you don't like them. But then some of them may be into it, but that's fine. You know, as long as they're okay. You just never know. But get out there. Go see the world. See the desert if you live near a desert. Go. Hang out in the snow. Snow's great. Especially if you got sleds, like snowmobiles. Yes. 
Skadoos. Just don't go out on, 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 on cross-country skis. Those guys look like idiots. All right. I'm kidding. Anybody who likes country, country cross-country skiing? I'm sorry. It was a joke. Oh, so we got aliens in this episode, too. Everything has happened in this episode. We did a bike with a bus engine, which was horrible, and it almost overheated my bus engine. Oh, great. Now we can't find a building for love and money. Yeah, we're over our distance we needed to make, so we're good there. Well, this has been a not-too-bad episode. We've had some mishaps. We found some new hubcaps. That's cool. Still haven't found a Skoda. Two episodes in. Looking for one. What's this? This is a bus stop. I want a real place to stop. That's not a bus stop. That's just a tiny gas station. That seems like a terrible place to stop. Moon's going down. Yep. Yeah. Been a good day, though. Oh, for a second there, I thought that was a bridge. It was just like where the grass and the lights shine together. Those aliens, though, there's got to be more to that story. And it's such a random occurrence because it's been a long time. I think I just drove by a building. Oh, well. How's my gas doing? Well, we're getting down, so... Yeah. Three quarters of a tank, I guess. That's not too bad, actually. If I'm reading that right. Whatever happened to E and F, you know, or whatever language the car's in, that's fine. I can figure out letters from other countries. I'm not I'm not stupid. I don't need people to speak English. Actually, I don't want most people to speak to me at all. So, <laughs> speak another language I don't understand. I prefer it. That way I don't have to interact with any humanity. And I can just do this. This is this is the way I like to interact with people. Okay. I do enough interact with people from a job. I don't want to do my spare time. What's wrong with people? Going out and doing things. I don't even know anymore. Yeah, this is good. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, look at that. Look at my sexy face in the in the mirror. Hello. <laughs> it's like a horror movie. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, no, it didn't do it right. Dun, dun, dun. Yep. It's like a really bad horror movie. Oh, I've got some Evil Dead guys. Watch Evil Dead. It's a great movie. It's a great TV show. Ash versus Evil Dead. Ugh. Is there any... Like, seriously, the one-liners that Bruce Campbell spits out, man, they're the best. Shoot first, think never. Yes, it's a great one-liner. Groovy. Yeah, it was so good. <laughs> oh, I'm going to watch that. You know, I'm going to watch that later if I get a chance. Ash vs. Evil Dead. This TV show ran for three seasons. It's too bad they canceled it, man. That was a great show. Okay, building. I just need a little one. Nothing too fancy. I don't need any... I don't need a Sheridan. Hell, I'll sell for a, a motor lodge right now. Oh, sun's coming up. This is good. This has been a good episode, man. This is working out great. No problems. No flipping the car everywhere. Well, we rolled on our side upside down once, but that's, it was real easy to fix. Although, I don't see my broom anymore. Oh, yeah, broom's in the passenger seat. Good work, broom. Definitely skinnier than my first wife, Karen. A little too skinny. She probably, probably eat something, buddy. Oh, here comes the sun. Maybe the sun will lead to new, new and uh, interesting opportunities. We like new and interesting opportunities. There we go. What is going on here? Why is there no buildings? Show me a building. I want to burn through all my gas. Because this thing goes through about half a liter per kilometer. Yeah, we're already down to three quarters of a tank, I think. All right, that's fine, though. Probably just sit there and watch the gas gauge move. It wasn't for all the rocks on the road. I still would like to know why the aliens are just cruising down highways. I mean, got, like, do they don't have a map or something? You know, they just got to, just got to drive. Take a left! Take a left! <laughs> oh, yeah. Aliens are so dumb. Okay. Oh, here we go. We got a big garage coming up. It's a perfect place to stop. Right in the dawn? Why, why is it so damn yellow? <laughs> that should be the end of the game. When you get near the end of this, they should just, uh, the aliens should, like, like, abduct you. Right right as you get to the end. 
That should be the very end of the game. Oh, what? this is a big building. Oh, it's a big garage. We'll take a peek in here. We're way over our kilometers now, right? Oh, yeah, we're way over. We're good. All right. Pulling on in. Take a little break here. Stop. Okay. This has been a long one, man. <laughs> it's really been long. Okay. Get out of this. All right. It's because we stopped so much and we're looking around. But really, what we need is road lo Road lotion! Don't freeze, this stupid game! Yeah, okay. Oh, how I missed you. You and your fancy nozzle. Ah, yes. Road lotion. There we go. Oh! What's this? That's empty. This is a fairly sparse one, but that's cool. We can live with that. We can make this work. Should probably check our oil at some point, too. Oh, we don't have any oil here. This is just gas. It's an engine. That's just explosive. More road lotion in the corner. We're definitely going to need some oil. That's gas and oil. That's gas and oil. God damn it. Who keeps mixing this shit? Uh, gas again. Water coolant. Tank. Okay. Um, what's in this one? Is there anything in this one? Oil. Here we go. This will work. I don't know who puts it in here, but whatever. There we go. That'll fill that up. Boom. Done. Perfect. So, I'm going to end this episode here. Because um, this is as good as... Oh, I know what I'm going to do, actually. People keep warning me not to park my car so close to the building. So, we're going to park it over here. Brake on, ignition off. Okay. Because apparently, it just your walls eat cars. So, thank you so much for watching. If you like this, please leave a comment. Maybe subscribe. Hit the little bell. Because it dingles, and we like that sound, I think. Jacksepticeye's got that bell he's ringing all the time. Why wouldn't like bells? And if you didn't like this, you should probably find yourself a real YouTuber, because I'm not much of one. And if you're new here, welcome to the herd. This is Scapegoat. I don't want to do this when there's a rabbit right nearby, because they get all uppity, but that looks like a pretty, pretty calm one. Go away, rabbit. Out.